Bobcats! I'm Isabel Bernabio, your assistant web editor in chief. Welcome back to episode two of the Sage Pod here, there, and everywhere. I'm Leah Ertel, your entertainment editor. And I'm Julie Delisio, your sports editor. Today, we are going to be going over Sage Creek's annual hoop coming dance. This takes place on Saturday, February 4th in the gym from 7 to 10. Let's get into it. To get our Bobcats into the hoop coming spirit, ASB has planned a spirit week. Monday is early 2000s, dress like you're in the early 2000s. Tuesday, dynamic duo, so Patrick or SpongeBob. Wednesday, the spy who loved me, dress up like a spy. Thursday, bling empire, dress super fancy. Friday, <laughs> school colors, wear your Sage Creek gear. In addition to the Hoop Coming Spirit Week, we have our annual Hoop Coming Carnival on Friday, February 3rd, with a 3 p.m. dismissal. The admission is free, and the carnival will be taking place from 3 to 5.30 p.m. out on the Athletic Mall. It is open to the entire North County community, so make sure you bring your friends and family and come out to enjoy food, carnival games, and all of the fun. In addition to the carnival, we will be having our basketball game right afterwards, so make sure you come out and support your fellow Bobcats. If you went to the fall formal, there's no need for a dance agreement. However, if you're going to go to this one and you didn't go to the fall formal, you're going to need a dance agreement. Guests need new dance agreements, even if you're bringing the same person. $40 with an ASB sticker is your price, and $60 without. $65 for guests. Student store kiosk will be open for ticket sales during lunch on the following dates. Monday, January 30th at lunch and after school. Tuesday, January 31st at lunch after school. Wednesday, February 1st, at lunch and after school. Thursday, February 2nd, at lunch and after school. And the last day to purchase tickets on the web store will be on Friday, February 3rd, 2023, at 1 p.m. No tickets will be sold at the door. At the dance, various activities could include dancing, of course, drinks, appetizers, desserts, and access to additional entertainment such as games, photo booths, and etc. This year's theme for Hoop Coming is 007 or James Bond. Let's talk about different types of dresses or suits to wear. So typically in a James Bond, the women have long, fancy, kind of dark, flowy. mysterious. Yeah, flowy. flowy. Dark, mysterious, and flowy colors. and Open leg. Open leg, yeah, yeah. Slits up the leg. I definitely see a lot of slits in the James Bond movies. I see a lot of sparkles. Mm-hmm. A lot of cocktail dresses, kind of. Yeah, I I also see that some of the most popular colors are definitely black, red, even like a dark purple or green. Emerald green. Yeah, Yeah. that's my dress. It's um, it's this long, flowy green dress, and it's sparkly, and it's kind of emerald, and it has a slit up the leg. What's your dress like, Leah? Feathers and (laughs) stripes. Short, cocktail-y, but it's cute. It works. I don't have a dress. Well, what are you looking for buying? Well, I definitely want a flowy long one with a slit, but like, I don't know. I don't know what color to get yet. I'm looking at blue, but there isn't really that much blue in James Bond, is there? I think, I think if you got like a dark blue, not like a baby blue, it definitely could work. Yeah. It's just darker colors that I usually see. Navy blue, maybe. Yeah, navy blue would be really nice. Or royal blue. Um, as for, you know, more masculine outfits, I typically see the classic suits that are black or gray, along with a bow tie or just a regular tie. Um, I don't know, you could, you know, bling it up by adding a flower, like a rose in the pocket with a pocket square. Or a handkerchief in the pocket. Yeah. If you really want to go f- all for it, you could add some glasses that you'll be wearing at night in the gym. Yeah. Oh, and cufflinks, you know. <laughs> or you could completely ditch the whole suit outfit. You could wear combat boots, gloves, <laughs> suspenders, cargo pants, the classic James Bond's outfit when he's in action. You could put on a, Rola- a Rolex watch if you want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you could do that. Cop glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Aviators. <laughs> Harness. <laughs> you can go all out. Oh, yeah. If people went with the all white suit, I would oh, definitely, yeah, yeah. definitely love their outfit. Their outfit would be so cool. You gotta have the red flower. Yeah, and then have the red rose. Or the black bow tie. Or a pink tie with the white shirt and suspenders. <laughs> suspenders, I mean, yeah. Suspenders. 
<laughs> that's a James Bond look, surprisingly, but yes. <laughs> All right, that's it for this week, Bobcats. We hope to see you at the Hoopcoming Dance on Saturday, February 4th. We will be there. Make sure you guys be there as well. It will be so much fun. Tune in for next week, all about Girl Scout cookies.